Here we are again. Welcome everybody to OP360. Uh, it's Wednesday, the 23rd. Hump day! Anyway, we got a lot to cover. Uh, we're going to go over some different things. And Red, as usual, will do an update for the seven days. I'm going to turn it over to him right now, make sure my YouTube channel is okay, and I'll be back. Thanks very much, Marty. Hi, Chris. How you doing? Good to be here on an OP360. My, does seven days fly by pretty quick in on passive. It certainly, certainly does. And here we are once again on an on passive 360. Back to our old format. Uh, no guests as far as we know, but you never know. Uh, things might happen. And here we are. Obviously, I'm going to give you the seven days in on passive. Lots have gone on this week. Going to bring that to you as well. Marty and Chris are going to do their thing. Got some information for you as well. So all in all, a really good 360 for you today. We do try our hardest, guys, uh, to keep you updated, up to date with what has got uh, going on in On Passive. The very least you should be doing is coming to On Passive 360 once a week to get at least the updates, what's happened in a week, and then you will be pretty up to date. Chris, over to you. Wow, wow, wow. Look at my two favorite brothers, Red and Marty DeGarmo and Red Fern. Can't put those two together. Uh, how you doing, guys? You're looking good. Let me tell you something. It rained. Has has Red said it was, was it pissing down? Is that how you say raining? Pissing down in Michigan today. Filled up my pool like three inches. It's still going at it. So I guess I'm not going fishing. Did I go fishing yesterday? I didn't. I had some things I had to do, but it's okay. But I want to let you know, you are in the best place, the greatest place in the world, not just on Passive 360, but in Passive in general, because it's going to take you places you never thought you could be. It's going to take you places where your dreams since a little kid are going to come true. So I'm excited. I don't know about you. Marty DeGarmo, thumbs up. Oh, happy birthday, Dina Maddie. You remember Dina with that crazy hair? I love that girl. Happy birthday, Dina. All right, Marty, you ready? I'm ready. I'm here. Can you hear me okay? Loud and okay. clear. Okay. Uh, yeah, another week went by. Uh, pretty exciting. Very exciting. Uh, I, I, I'm seeing people step up to the plate, getting out of their comfort zone. I'm seeing people uh, start to, I've, I've had some people come out of the woodwork that have not been around a while. And one, one couple got a hold of me and I'm really not into, you know, force feeding somebody something that they could have watched, but they had a pretty crazy life. And I helped them out. They got migrated. So they're happy. Couldn't believe how far we've come. I said, you ain't seen nothing yet. I believe that's a song. But anyway, um, yeah, beautiful. I uh, I looked at the back. We got a new website yesterday or uh, Monday, I mean. It was beautiful. Uh, I know that people are pretty excited. I, I'm, I, uh, I do some things in Facebook, and I'm seeing responses that are mind-blowing, absolutely mind-blowing. And people are starting to really visualize the potential of unpassive. Uh, the main thing that, that, that I try to do in Red and Chris is let you know this is your on passive. You know, you, there's no reason to think I can't do this because I can't. No, no, no. You do what you can do. Whatever you're doing. Listen, when Ask says something, he's not talking about somebody that's, you know, devoted and has uh, loyalty and all that. It's not about the size of your team. Let that go. Loyalty is you stuck with it. There's people that never wavered. I get it. People get nervous. We're humans. I get it. But I do want to tell you from experience and everything I've done, but mainly I'm passing. If you get to at least where I am, even if it's 1%, your, your anxiety level or what's going to happen, I'm not sure because the unknown, right? I don't have it. I, I really don't. I don't. I'm not worried about, oh, this is something, when's this going to happen? What's going to happen next? What's going to happen? Like questioning things. Listen, get get caught up. As Robin always says, live in the now. So let's get to now. 
are so many people worried about next week, week after week after, and they're still not caught up to now. At least get where we are. Be ready. Uh, we know that we're going to be able to purchase the first product, which is O-Connect. We are very fortunate, and we were blessed to find out. Or for one thing, when we heard about anything to do with a platform that's going to be used for video conferencing, uh, what I thought and what we got, I was wrong, 100% wrong. What we what we have is mind blowing. I did I did not know we would have all these extra features. And remember the what I remember for a couple of years now. As said, he's going to try to keep it. You know, just think about like three hundred dollars, three fifty. What did it wind up coming out? At least the first package here for three months, one twenty five. That's mind blowing. Ten thousand seats. <coughs> Go to anybody out there, any company. I don't care. I don't want to mention their name. We're not going to kill them. This, we're, we're building something for people. It's probably fifty to sixty percent more expensive. Newsflash, and they don't pay commission. So I don't know about you. I am stoked, <coughs> and it's so good. That I can, if I, if I'm giving away the free product, which is, you know, O Mail, O Net, O Trim, and I can tell people to come and use a free version of O Connect, I could do very, very well for me and my family and my family's family for the rest of my life. But to know this is only part of the course of things that are going to be brought to our table, only one. People call me or write me and say, you ever look at other streams of income? No. Why? Because I got freaking Niagara Falls coming. I got enough streams. It's endless. I'm going to have so many faucets of streams. Why would I? No, I'm good. I'm happy. <laughs> I don't need any more. I couldn't handle any more. <clears throat> and why do I say that? This goes for all of you. Product comes out. It's another stream. Product comes out. It's another stream. Product comes out. Another stream. As your teams grow, and let me explain to you. I know these people, people are worried about the size of their team. This game hasn't started yet. For me, not really. Here's what's going to happen. When your confidence builds because things are moving along, people will see you're about two inches taller. You got a little bounce to your walk. And they're going to want to know why. People will follow enthusiasm. Listen, I follow in the beginning. I'm following Ash because maybe I didn't see enough, but I knew whatever he's looking at, I want to know. And as time went on, this picture became clearer and clearer and clearer. And then I said, whoa. And then when I see everything that's going on, I say, wow, this is amazing. And then I get feedback saying, well, you only know about one, two percent. I'm like, listen, I'm good. Okay, I'm not getting up in the morning shaking. And what about nothing? If you want to get the feeling of satisfaction and know it's only going to get better, I'm already blown away. It's going to get better every day. Come on, get to that point. It'll take the anxiety away. But trust me, things will happen. All of the people you talk to. I know you talk. Everybody's talked to a lot of people. Most people, you know, I'm not doing that because you're the nut of the group. You join everything. You do everything. When they see this and they see what's happening, even the ones that said no, they're coming. They're coming. They're going to see it. They're going to see it. because remember the secret sauce of Unpassive is they over deliver. It's unlimited. It's state of the art. There's no hidden stuff. There's no tricky business. There's no small writing. There's no, well, if you do this, you get in, they go, well, that's good, but you get better if you did. That shenanigans aren't there. It's not there. You don't have to worry about your young adults going on a social media platform uh, that is a haven for low-life scumbags or predators or spineless individuals. Okay, and those people will never leave. They're going to be on this plant. They've been here from the beginning, different names. They're not going anywhere. 
But if you can get an environment where you go on and you have to verify who you are, I am Marty DeGarmo. I say what I say. Beautiful. Red says what he says. He'll put his name on it. Wait, right. that's, I believe in freedom of speech. I don't think there should be a freedom of bullying. There shouldn't be a freedom of beating somebody up and using some fake name. You want to do that? Stay where you are. But I tell you what's going to happen eventually. These areas that had havens for low life scumbags, it's only going to be them there eventually. Now, I want to go just watch it because it's going to be unbelievable. Low life, uh, punks, cowards, all in one spot. <laughs> Doing what? Scamming each other? Bullying each other? I mean, what a field day that would be fun just to watch. But anyway, Onet has this. You could come in. I feel good about my teenage grandchildren to see it. It's going to be fantastic. It's all about safe, clean, ethical, unbelievable value. And every product that comes out, AI, unlimited, always being updated. So even if you, when you come in and you see O-Connect, say, oh my God, this is the best I've ever seen. Not for long, because it's going to be enhanced. Everything is enhanced. Uh, they don't hire a team of tech people. I want you to build this product project. They do it and then they let them go. No, no, no. This is ongoing for good. And what people don't know watching this for the first time is that physical products we don't even know yet. That's gonna be that's gonna come into the picture. That's gonna come into the picture for all this. And I mean this and I say it every week and I'll probably say it for the next 500 weeks if I'm here. This company is going to be life support for other companies. It's not out to devour and conquer. We're not going to the village to village. We're building a city for everyone to come in because the, the biggest problem in all these other businesses, one of the biggest problems is traffic. The difference is all the traffic that you see in these social media, I don't want to mention names, are hacked. They take it, we weren't asked, and they use it and sell it and make billions, yeah, billions of dollars a year. And on passive, you come in, we're all in, nobody's selling, nobody's selling your stuff. You get in and you can walk through this mall of, of, of the universe of on passive, go to the mall, go to the... Uh, um, e-commerce, um, e right? Buy what you want, add what you want. You can put your business in some of these things as long as they're legit and upfront. And if they're good, they will stand for themselves. They, it, listen, the problem is people will have to, if I owned a company, I would come down passive because of the tools. Because everybody goes to these businesses naked and afraid. They don't know how to get traffic. They don't know how to get something. They don't know how to get a page. They don't know. All of it will be here. So I just want to emphasize, try it. You'll like it. You don't know any of us. Most of you do, but people watching us down the road, it doesn't cost anything to get in. In fact, they give you three gifts just for checking it out. And while you're in, there's, there's uh, even the paid products, you could test them for like seven days. What? the heck so anyway i'm going to turn it over to red and uh yeah i'm i'm stoked i have been i want everybody to see what i see i don't want to talk you in anything i'm not here to talk you into something N never that's a joke if you have to sell somebody you have to sell them every day they'll be back and be i went about this and i let no come in look for yourself we're adults everybody's it's it's super technology made simple anyway here's red thanks Thanks very much, Marty, and welcome everybody. Uh, as you probably know or don't know, uh, this On Passive 360 is going out live to many, many YouTube channels. So wherever you are viewing this on and whoever's channel you are viewing this, guys, please do that channel the honours and subscribe to it. Why am I asking you to subscribe to it? Because these people that we stream this on Passive 360 and many other on Passive videos too is a great source of information, whether it be in English, whether it be in Hindi or Japanese or wherever, whatever the channel is, 
is a great source of information. So subscribe to it, ring that bell, and you will be notified whenever that channel uploads any more information onto it. On another thing, as Marty has just said, there is many people who is uh, viewing this right now who aren't even in on passive. They are looking for information about on passive. And again, underneath this video, whichever YouTube channel you are on, there will be uh, information in the description about on passive, how you can go to it, sign up for free. Yes, that is free, no money. Find out and look for yourself. You can use the free um, products that are there. As Marty said, just by signing up, you get access to three of those products completely free and you can make up your own mind, whatever you want to do. It is no uh, restrictions whatsoever. Don't need credit cards. Don't need anything like that. Just a name and your email. Boom, you're in. Good to go. OK, so here we are then on a recap of the last seven days in on passive. Let's start off then with one week ago, seven days, and it was on Passive 360 once again. Uh, before we get into what happened on 360, what happened in on Passive Land last Wednesday? Well, we saw a brand new pop-up in our ecosystem, our OES, telling us that on Friday of last week, so three days from then, we were going to have a new Burj Khalifa. Burj Khalifa, for those that don't know, it is the tallest building in the world. And this is situated in Dubai. And on Passive, do a video laser light show to advertise on Passive on the front of it. The biggest billboard in the world. And we advertise on it. And that is in Dubai. That happened on Friday. We get, had a pop-up in your ecosystem. That's the OES that that was happening on Friday. And also there was going to be a meeting straight after it on our very own video conferencing solution called O-Connect. That was advertised for us in our ecosystem for Friday. We also had an, another two day, uh, sorry, seven day extension on O-Connect and uh, O-Tracker. So those you can use for free for the following seven days. And then we did on Passive 360 and we had a very cool guest. Our very own Snoop Dogg himself, Mr. Qua. He was on with us and boy, did he speak well. Marty talks about diamonds in the rough and we find them and we push them to the top. This guy, what a story he had. Extremely articulate certainly talked from the heart and soul of his body about his journey, what he's looking for in on passive and really what he is looking for on passive to do for him and his community. He's from some weird place near New York called New Jersey. New Jersey, is it, Chris? I've never heard of it. Or oh, Apparently a load of really strange people live in New Jersey. I've never heard of it before. But anyway, that's where he was from. And what a nice guy he was. It was really good to hear from him and we wish him all the luck. And I hope that he gets invited on to many other uh, on passive shows to tell his story as well. Thursday came around. Obviously, we, uh, us three here, we're doing our lives, explaining things about the new pop up, what to expect, etc. And then Friday came around. What happened on Friday? Yep, we had a joint another 360 an extra extra 360 just before the Burj Khalifa uh, laser light show uh, we did that for about 10 minutes to get you all excited and then we went over to either the YouTube channels or to O connect itself uh, to watch that display now I'm just going to talk very briefly about the laser light show on Burj Khalifa it was a new one to unveil uh, the paid part of what is coming for O-Connect, uh, the commercial side of it, absolutely amazing. Our CMO, uh, Mohammed uh, Kamal, he's our chief marketing officer, uh, did a sterling job. I'll tell you, it was amazing. At the start, we had a little uh, robot thing floating around that was dragging up O-Connect all the way to the top of the Burj Khalifa. And then obviously the story and the music behind O-Connect. Absolutely brilliant. And then we had a four hour 
O-Connect session with our CEO and uh, Mohamed Nassal, Mohamed Kanmal. They were both there as well and plenty of people on the panel to help our CEO out as well. Lots and lots of information was given. I'm not going to go over it here now on this recap. If you are a founder in on Passive, you can get this information by logging into your O Founders back office, going to the updates section, and there is some excellent, excellent notes in there, which has been written by Daryl Cook, Peter Sarur, and our very own Janet, Janet Butler from the Bahamas. They collaborate to put these notes together for you guys, and many, many other uh, people have done their own lives uh, as well to get the message out in a recap form of what went on uh, on the Friday webinar. It's safe to say, guys, we are it's close now. OK, it really is. As I said on my live yesterday, a quest, uh, just a question of polishing up that car, giving it that brand new smell and rolling it out onto the forecourt to be picked up by the customer. That's how close we are now. All of the nasty, nitty gritties, painting, adding bits and all the rest of it, that's all been done. We are definitely on the polishing stage as now. We then saw on Friday night, uh, we saw our CEO once more. Why? Because he was on the Roblin late night show that's on every single night at 8 p.m. Eastern uh, Daylight Time. Why was he on that? Because it was their one year anniversary. Congratulations to Rob Gorman and Lynn Nakamoto for one whole year doing your Rob Lynn show. And Ash came on. He had such a good time, guys. He wore about 10 hats, was larking around, having good fun. And it was really nice to see him relaxed and kicking back. And uh, a good time was had by all, I'm absolutely sure. Saturday, and what happened on Saturday? I did a couple of recaps. Marty did a recap. And then we had Sunday, we saw the notes in the back office, which I've just talked about now. They were popped in there by Daryl Cook and Peter Saru and Janet Butler. Monday, what happened on Monday? We had a brand new website. Now, we get very excited in On Passive when Mondays come because that is the day that for the last good two, three months or more now that we see the brand new website. This comes from the uh, marketing department, uh, which Mohamed Nassal is the CMO of. And this one was, in my opinion, loved it. Why? Because it was different from the one before. They all seem to be different in their little quirky ways. What was different about this one compared? It had a completely different scrolling action on the right-hand side to any one else of the websites that we've seen. You scroll it and it was a bit like being in the opening credits of Star Wars. You know, when you've got the um, text and it's coming towards you and it gets bigger and bigger and bigger and then fades out. That's kind of how it was looking a little bit like that. You, you scroll down, it comes out towards you and you're reading it and you can scroll it backwards and forwards. And then it goes on to the next page and the next page. Absolutely loved it. It was really pointing towards what the artificial intelligence part of On Passive is going to be doing for businesses, individuals. It was explaining how the integration of artificial intelligence into the On Passive ecosystem, the products and services, is going to benefit the user and the business person. Loved it, loved it, loved it. And as I said last week, this is the second week in a row that we've got that new uh, About Us section in the On Passive uh, website. A great port of call, guys, to send anybody who says to you, what's On Passive? What, what's, it, what's it all about? Very easy, guys. Send it to OnPassive.com. Say, click About Us. There you go. Then you can pick them up after they've had a good read of it and say, have you got any questions for me? Uh, what else did we say? Uh, Monday as well, if you are a Twitter follower or X, whatever you want to call it these days, uh, Mohamed Kamal, our CMO, he uses Twitter a lot and is an avid uh, user of it. And we found out that he was on his way to Hyderabad on Monday. Uh, he took a nice little picture of Hyderabad from the, air, uh, from the plane. So 
we wish him well uh, for whatever he's doing over there, teaming back up with Mohamed Kamal as well. So that is going to be absolutely fantastic. We also got a quote uh, from OnPassive.com in Twitter as well by a, girl, a lady called Jill uh, Conrath. She's a um, strategist, sales, marketing, uh, and also speaker and author. And it was a really good quote that they put on there. Yesterday, not much went on, guys, I'm afraid, as far as uh, Tuesday on on Passive. And here we are, Wednesday once again. And I will recap what happened today, next week. That's it for me. Chris, over to you. Wow, wow, wow. You guys got a lot of air in those lungs. Let me tell you. Nice job, Red. Nice job, Marty. Let's see if I can uh, put some air in mine. First of all, I want to thank, uh, again, like Red said, all the people that are sharing their YouTubes. Please like and subscribe to all of them, guys. They are important because they give you updated information from not just us, but from a lot of a lot of individuals. You know, uh, and I'm going to mention Qua for a second because he brought me on to something. But let me first tell you something. Right now, the world is, it's a little bit crazy. You know, we have we have wars going on. We have, we have fires. We have things that are uncontrollable. Uh, we got mean people, bad people, crazy people. And uh, believe it or not, all this was thought about for those reasons alone, to help the little man, the small man. And uh, never in my life have I ever paid attention to law of attraction or law of attraction until Qua brought it to my attention about these movies, which was one was called Secret Dare to Dream, and there was another one called The Secret. Um, and I've been really watching this movie over and over again, and it makes a lot of sense. So. I kind of want to bring some of that law of attraction to all of you because once again, I'm a, I'm a prayer guy. I believe law, law of attraction is the same thing, asking for goodness. And I, and I found this quote on the, the one movie I was watching by Joseph Campbell. And he said, follow your bliss and the universe will open doors where there were only walls. And I thought about that. For a second, and I thought, man, that's that's really cool. So as I watched this movie, I realized some of the most successful people in the world follow that same path. Uh, the secret, the secret to success, the secret to happiness, is to believe all the time in blissfulness. Believe all the time that anything that's good, take out anything that's bad and throw it away. Just think positive. Wake up in the morning every day like I do and uh, tell myself, put God first before everything I do. But also, listen, I made myself a little sheet. In this movie, uh oh, in this movie, they tell you uh, that you should make a list. And I did make a list, and I thought a little list I'm going to show you about what I mean by this. A lot of you probably know this already. I never paid attention to it, but I'm really glad I did. Um, draw everything good to you, period. Uh, stuff like... And I say this for myself, but also on passive, I kind of want to make it a passive list today. And for a homework assignment, you know, I like giving homework assignments. I want you to add to that list. So I thought about this the last two days. Uh, and passive will create success and all. I'm constantly going to think this. Now, I already know it. One of the biggest problems, I think, for, uh, and it's not a problem. It's just something out there, is people don't always believe in passive. We have some founders that have doubts because it's really hard to believe what it's going to do to our lives. But let's all start saying that. And passive is going to create wealth for all. Okay. And passive will fix all things that are broken. You got to believe this. All right. If we all believe this together, they say law of attraction. This comes to you. This stays in you. It sends out this amazing uh, thing in the atmosphere and it surrounds you with it. Uh, a passive will put hope in the hearts of many. A passive will keep giving. A passive will allow all your dreams to come true. A passive will lift up humanity. A passive will ignore evil because it will bless and help a lot of people out. Now, that's just a small list I made, uh, and I believe it. I, I, it's not easy to do. In other words, and I gave an example last week, if you... Wake up and say you stub your toe or you bang your knee. Right away, you're you're in the, you're allowing the rest of your day to be that way. All right. Uh, if you bang your toe, it hurts you up. 
If you bang your knee, your your funny bone, which is never funny, right away, what do you say? Honest to God, truth, you say, oh, my God, I hope the rest of my day doesn't go like this. Guess what you just did? You just failed because you just told yourself the rest of my day is going to be crap. All right. Turn it to a positive. Turn it to a positive. And I said this, I know I'm repeating it. I don't like repeating myself, but thank God I had a knee to bang. Thank God I had an elbow to crack on a counter because a lot of people don't have that elbow or knee. Turn it into a positive. Don't take the negativity completely out of your body. And I and I really believe this is what Ash Mafara was thinking 20 years ago about saying, we just got to get rid of the negative. We got to get rid of the, the things that are wrong. And to this day, the greatest men in the world that did to try to change humanity do the right thing, you're going to get some people that don't like you. That's normal. And in my my personal theory, my opinion, is if you took all those kind of people and you put them on an island with the greatest tools in the world as far as building buildings, uh, educational, everything, you know what would happen to that island? It would never change because these people are too busy looking at them, worrying about what they're doing. Oh, you'll never do that. And that's what I'm saying. Now, on our island, in a passive island, Ash Bafara has given us all these tools. He's given us tools to help build each of us a business, a company that we can be proud, proud of. No point in fingers. I mean, this guy did it all. I'm, I'm, that is my thing where I'm saying he really did all of this for us and he, he left no stone unturned. The worst thing, the hardest thind I think I ever do is I got to sign my ND. Well, that took a lot of work, but he really created a passive For, for everyone that wants it, to be honest with you. And right now, this world is, you know, uh, Maui, it burned to the ground. $5.5 billion dollars to rebuild Maui. We got a war going on between Russia and, and uh, Ukraine. $40 billion dollars donated already, ready to Russia. For what? To tear more things down? Here's my theory. I want to donate money to people that's going to build things before it gets tore down. I want to help people uh, exactly build their dreams up regardless. I don't want to have to say, oh, there's another war. We got to help these people out. All right. I never like war. That's my opinion. But I believe a pastor also is going to change many, many things when it comes to this stuff. I believe as the wealth of the world grows because of a passive, you're going to have a lot less hate I believe, because what it is, is the world is money driven. Uh, it's dirty driven. It's it's uh, last man standing. One thing I love about a passive, that's not what it is. Uh, and passive has never been me, myself and I, or the last man standing. It's about getting as many people as you can, holding hands. And if you want to say kumbaya, that's what it is, because we believe in the same thing. Fairness, equality, love, peace, wealth, success. All these things, that's what a passive means when you say the word on passive. All those great things. Michael Williams said something the other day last week about we have free, we have all this stuff. And I love that he said it. Actually, I want to write it all down and stick it on my refrigerator because I want to read every day. Because that's, you have to constantly remind yourself how great a passive is. Why? Because there's so many things to be thankful for in a passive. Number one is the products which what a lot of people say we don't have, <clears throat> we have them. I guarantee you, and you're going to see them soon. Uh, we have the greatest people in the world, which are the founders, the most giving, loving people I've ever seen from all over the world, not just America. All right. Oh, and congratulations to India for getting to that part of the moon. I absolutely love seeing that. Never would have knew about it if I wasn't in passive. I probably never would have paid attention. But realizing the culture of India and what they're all about, fell in love with India, fell in love with Bangladesh, Australia, New Zealand, Africa, great people all over the world that have the same dream as we do. All right, now, they got to the moon. Ash Mafara wants to go beyond the moon. He wants to go beyond the stars. He wants to go to places, like they say, Tim Dillon says, going places where no man's ever gone before. I believe he's going to create that everywhere. Uh, listen, you're going to think this is funny. Someday you're going to see a, uh, a, a 
a passive office on the moon. That's my opinion. That's how much I respect this guy and how, how, how strong I think his mind is because he doesn't let him stop. He just keeps going, going, going. That's in passive. All right. The law of attraction. One more time. Think positive thoughts every day. And it, it, it takes practice. If you're going to say when you wake up in the morning, I want to be the most successful person that I can be. Say it. Believe it. I want to create things in this world that's going to help anyone out there. Say it and believe it. Keep passing on these positive thoughts to you. Uh, and when you're saying that, include in passive because honest to God, Ford Motor Company, I worked for 32 years. They just said, we're going to build a car. All right. Uh, Ash Bafara says, oh, no, no, we're going to change lives. Ford Motor Company said, we're going to get you from point A to point B. Ash Mafara said, unlimited. You see what I'm saying? It's not for him. It's for all of us. And a lot of you still don't understand that. You are, you have the, a CEO that really does care about this world, about the ground you walk on, about the people that surround you with. He loves everyone. He gives everyone that opportunity to say, just come on with me, check it out. I'm really gonna do it all for you. And like I said, no one has ever told me that in my entire life. So I could go on and on, but I just want you guys to think that I'm passive for my, my opinion. I know a lot of you is the most positive thing I've ever been part of and belong to. Okay. And I believe, and I know, and I tell myself this every day that a passive is going to completely change my life for the better. It's going to knock out every piece of negativity in my body. In my body, period. If I think of something negative, first thing I do is a passive is going to help me with this. When I see someone sitting on the street starving, laying there in the cold with a newspaper over them, I'm going to think about a passive and I'm going to think about, oh, bless. All right. I told a lady yesterday, I'm done walking over people that are laying on the ground. It's time we stop and we pick them up and we help them. Welcome to Unpassive. We're not walking over anybody. We're giving everyone the opportunity. Matter of fact, we're going to work real hard so that no one is laying on the ground or holding a sign working for food. It's unbelievable what a passive is going to do. And uh, it, it, I'm emotional because this company made me emotional. This company made me think about things I never flipping thought about ever. More, more than me, I am not worthy but other people are, that's how I think. I'm putting other people way before me. Now, is that good? Yes, I think it's good because I already know about me. Do I want to help out every single child in this world that's right now, at, at this second, hasn't had clean water in three days or a meal to eat in three or four days? Yes, I will be the proudest man in the world knowing that when I die, these kids are all being fed every single day because of founders, because of passive and because of Obless. It's a nonstop giving company. And I'll say it again, you'll never meet anyone, anyone like Ash Mafara, because that's what he preaches. He doesn't argue. He says, this is what I'm gonna do. He would tell me, Chris, if you paid all attention to all this negative stif stuff that's going on, you'd never get anything done. Absolutely correct. This is why when people say, Chris, did you let Ash know? Listen, Ash knows all about negativity, about this, but guess what he does? He'll tell you, I'm not going to spend my time thinking about the negative things people are saying. I'm going to spend my time being productive and build things that no one's ever seen before that's going to help the world. Enough said. I think it passive is great, and I think people should at least try it out. And if you don't like it, go on your way. But I promise you, I'll say the same thing Ash said. You will, you will be using an passive product. Whether it's an invention, a tool, uh, everything in this world in the next 10 years, you're going to see a passive's name on it. That's my guarantee. And I love it. Marty DeGarmo, I had nothing. It's back to you, brother. I, I am so glad you had nothing. <laughs> I don't know what would happen. If you ever said I got something, I'm going to be afraid. I might even get off. Um, one thing I want to say, look, there's something I, I know for sure in the 63 years I've been blessed to be on this planet. You are always 100% right. If you believe you can, you can. If you believe you can't, you won't. 
And the only limitations are not five miles down the road, they're not a hundred miles down the road, they're not on the moon, they're between your ears. I'm passing as a platform that we can all live far beyond we ever what we ever dreamed of. Don't look at the product's name, think of the possibilities, what they can do and what this platform can do. Everything is so much bigger than the name itself. Uh, Red, do you have anything else? Because uh, at Mr. Mufara yep. is here. Is he Is he here right now, is he? Yeah. yeah Who's Ash Mufara? <laughs> no way. I was going to say something, but seeing he's here, then uh, I'll make way for Mr. Mufara. Who's that handsome young man? <laughs> Thank it's you me, so it's, much. It's, it's me, Chris. <laughs> Fantastic. So remind me, please. Uh, hello, everyone. Uh, so last week, who you've had on uh, on Passive 360? Why? 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 All right, high bar. Okay, and the week before, everybody, everybody. Well, some some well, average well, people, some middle no, of the no, apples. No, 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 no. I know some of the name. Say it. <laughs> Tell me. Okay. Ask Mufara. Before, before. Okay. Julie Wen we had, uh, and. Michael Julie, Williams, Julie, uh, Michael Charles O'Song, Robin Noble, the Inner uh, Apple, the Inner, Inner Apple. Apple, intelligent people. I see. And for some odd reason, you decided to drop the bar today. Like it was so high, you're having good results, and you said, "Ah, we have extra. Let's just tone wow. it down a little bit." Well, yeah, why would you want me to be here? We removed the bar. I'm just kidding. <laughs> we removed it. No. All right. <laughs> I'm delighted to be here. I'll tell you what. I can't talk about, you know, cover the last 15 minutes, to be honest with you. Uh, there's so much going on here. Uh, we're at high times and on passive, uh, proactively, productively. And uh, I agree with you, uh, uh, Chris. I heard what you're saying just now. Uh, not only that, every time I get these signs uh, in my mind, there we go one step further one step ahead this is a sign that you're growing that you're important all right uh so if you want to talk to me about solutions like successful people i will talk to you all day long okay i will stay up with you like i've done it many times until 4 3 a.m anytime <clears throat> want to talk to me about uh negativity and all that i got no time for that so unsuccessful people what do they talk about others people providing no solution and they're unknown successful people what they talk about solutions possibilities positivity hope optimism so let's talk about that on passive is really uh working hard uh in in many ways uh red was mentioning you know our team and dr Tariq flew there from uh, egypt and we have people all all across you know they're just uh why because it's important for us to nail it. It's important. I mean, I call it the super kingdom, not the United Kingdom. Uh, we're going to call it the super kingdom. You start, you you uh, you settle, you set up, okay, and then uh, you stabilize, you you scale, and then you soar. S S S S every way. Uh, I love. I love the composure that our executives having not in any way getting affected by short-term driven results or pressure we're so focused as we're just on a on a, an island totally separated i like that uh, and i think uh, it makes sense uh, it is not as easy. You, you sometimes you care, but uh, for them. Uh, but at the same time, uh, we want to make sure we are not making decisions. And this is a based on on uh, as a reaction. Uh, this is a big mistake. It's a fatal mistake. I've seen it before. In many companies, they start becoming react. You know, when some uh, stones are thrown at them. Uh, they start behaving in a in a in a way that they're just reacting to what happened. So they're no longer proactive. They're no longer um, in the lead, uh, but 
we uh, are far ahead in the game and we have so many intelligent qualified experts to settle with something less than perfect or uh, super professional uh, we are very confident about our products uh, not only that uh, uh, about our vision which is there's no way i've seen something personally listen i'm a guy i do pay attention to what's happening especially economically technologically uh in in different sectors i care i love to see you know what's happening so i do follow up and i try to get the most in the quickest time uh geopolitics is not necessarily uh where i i spend time but it's important to know what's happening because that affects technically every sector or the details of our life and for that i have I, I have seen a lot and I still see today. I do believe that with what we offer in on, on passive will help humanity to get ahead in a positive way and in a clean way. I do believe we can accomplish, we can achieve more and there's much higher potential hitting in our human race that just Due to those bureaucracies and uh, uh, traditional systems, uh, we're, we're way behind. Yeah, congratulations, India. But I thought, you know what? So India has some of the most intelligent phys uh, phys uh, uh, phys uh, physicists, okay, uh, uh, mathematicians in, in all, you know, sciences. And when... I heard the news, I said, why did it take you this long? Finally? Yeah, because you got the best. You should have been there. Like you should have had, I don't know, uh, a, 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 a crit, uh, what is it? Uh, a cricket field on the moon f from, the from the 90s or even before that. Anyway, that's a joke, guys. Uh, but... I want to talk about what's happening in, in the impassive land, which we we really lined up ourselves in such a way that we will impact more sectors than just the IT. And in, in a way, it is sad that we stopped sharing what's happening on those avenues in a way, uh, because some people deserve to be excited to know what's happening. They can plan their life. They can be aware. And you know what? The knowledge aspect of it, uh, to, to live it uh, from the early stages, the from the beginning. So for a while, we have not put information, new information for our innovative uh, uh, agenda. And that's the set. But the good part is people have no idea. The public or the uh opposition in a way they have no idea what we have and this is what gives us you know the highest level of confidence and and you know um put us at ease because if they just know what we're doing and that's that's refreshing and that's uh uh assuring in many way so uh yeah so You've invited some intelligent people for some reason. He said, now we we just had to tone it down a little bit. And I cannot talk m more, you know, than 15 minutes what happened on the last. But I can tell you, uh, we, uh, we are uh, very uh, strict about fine tuning our products. You know, they're just about to come out, uh, stick into our gut uh, guns and, you know, not uh, changing things or doing wishy-wash. Uh, uh, moves just as a defense mechanism. Uh, we're just going to do what we believe is right and at the right time. Uh, however, we see is suitable. The rest, it's irrelevant. Uh, I know on passive is a done deal. It does not rely in any way on Ash Mufari or, or his neighbors or uh, or a country or a town or none of that. On passive is in good uh, shape, in good hands. And there are so many people that will uh, take it. I, I thank our uh, leaders, executives uh, on any side, you know, uh, everybody's 
doing their best and you know we're so delighted to have attracted some of the finest people uh, in many corners of the planet uh, so we um, we have a few finished uh, again uh, products and uh, uh, steps and milestones uh, just making sure you know the perfectionism and, and, and you know the perfecting of these uh, elements is important so we are just about uh, to really give some uh, incredible news uh, we have changed a few things in the ecosystem setup on the app the mobile app uh, the for, for you know logistically and I believe it's gonna um, astonish you it's gonna be a great surprise a very positive uh, it's we've simplified it yet made it more powerful uh, and you know it just because of the intelligent people the level is so high uh, with the ideas I'm gonna meet up right now with them again and in a few hours again so it's really high time with us uh, all all around the clock and I believe uh, we're just about to uh, give you some breakthroughs, some break news, some uh, incredible surprises that will put a big, huge smile on, on your face and you're going to forget about the nonsense, the uh, uh, useless stuff. We're going to focus on what matters and be busy with uh, exciting, um, you know, uh, beautiful uh, changes and a new uh, shift in our life. Uh, I'm committed. We have a an array of, of agenda until, you know, months ahead. Okay, I would say that are very condensed in, in a good way. Uh, and I can't wait to for you to start seeing what we're cooking and what we're uh, working on and what we've been working so hard on for a long time. Our teams are really, really capable of, uh, I would say, making miracles in a metaphor way okay uh, they they are making things that are just not typical we're not used to them and you're gonna see a new way um, in in the market you're gonna see a new way of the you know technology or new uh, simplified way of utilizing technology and AI uh, perhaps uh, expanding and disrupting other sectors as well eminently and um, you know i'm glad we didn't share that because some people are gonna look so silly okay and uh, we uh, we loved it we loved that oh wow that made sense i was you know soaking internally because i want to share like i want to tell susie what's happening i want to tell uh, you know my brothers i want to tell my sisters i want to i can't and you know no 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 hush they kept hushing me okay um but I'm not even talking about the people you know and on passive. We're talking about people you have not seen, you have no idea, uh, you don't even know their countries or location. We worked uh, in, in, I would say, a level of privacy that was necessary to protect our inventions. And uh, I'm proud of what we've done and what we will continue doing. And I want to make sure that this will never stop because uh, it's a triple D, uh, you know, uh, mentality I have. Uh, personally, I will do this every day. Uh, I will go back. I will go to hell and back every day uh, because of the purpose. It's so beautiful and it's so worth it. Uh, I want to say congratulations to the winners of the cash prizes uh, on the YouTube contest. In fact, uh, the very first one, uh, the gentleman from uh, Morocco, Youssef, uh, has received his $10,000 cash. I can confirm that today. So that was done. The uh, Filipino and the uh, Czech Republic, I believe, um, they're, they have transferred the money. I don't know if they're reflected in their bank account. So they were uh, co uh, coordinating with the team. So that is done. We're still waiting for the information from the last two. Uh, winners from India, the the 2,000 and the 1,000, uh, the, the smallest were still good. Uh, we're waiting for their bank information because uh, we can uh, initiate those transfers as well immediately once we get a hold of that. So it's about 
hopefully this week it will be done. So that is done, but the top three are done from our side. Some have received it uh, directly and uh, confirmed, and some just about to confirm that. So it happened. Uh, I am so happy that uh, this will put a smile on their face and you know uh, excite you that this could happen to you uh, more frequently. Uh, and uh, not just depending on luck or small action. You can actually um, be in control and, and take it all the way. Uh, take the necessary action to get to that level or even higher and uh, this will be a beautiful life. Now, just to clarify for uh, this uh, winner in uh, Morocco, you know, he uh, pledged uh, $1,000 to uh, Obless. Just to clarify, for us, we're not going to subtract 1000 So what do we do with it? So we said, you take care of that. You do whatever cause you believe. Um, they spoke with uh, Mr. Mohammed Kamal and they said, um, you know, yeah, we know some people are in need uh, in their uh, region and uh, this will be a quite uh, help. So do that and we are also as a company, if there's anything else we can, um, you know, contribute, we are delighted to do it as well, since we know how to get uh, help to them there. Uh, so this is good. Uh, it's a it's a win, 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 win situation. I thank my brothers here, but please keep the bar high. OK, so uh, let me go back to my people. <laughs> And, uh, well, you are my people too, but uh, to uh, finish the task. But if Thank you have you any question much. or any topic, uh, brother, if you <clears throat> if you have anything, I'm, I'm happy to um, say that. Are you still, uh, still... I have one question, if this bar isn't quite too high for you. I'm joking. Uh, <laughs> do, you, do you think there'll be a webinar yes. this so you can even read my mind. We're raising the bar as you speak. You know that, right? We're, we're yes. bringing it back up. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Okay, thank you. That's the plan. More toward the Ash, end of the week. Yeah. Ash, whilst you're on here, actually, uh, I have uh, put it into my memory bank of uh, what you were ripping into me on Friday because I wasn't there on the meeting. And uh, I will use it at an occasion that suits in some way in the, in the future. I wasn't there. <laughs> that was my avatar. Yeah, uh, it was my AI yeah, Ash. It was. yeah, it was. Yeah, you're right. Uh, it by the way, AI Ash is really good. Oh, uh, that was amazing. That was amazing. They could have improved me. Well, I take advantage. You got a chance to revamp me. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know. <laughs> I, I, got, you my, my, Ash, I, I got, I got to, I got to be, I got to confess. Mm. We tried to get the avatar on of you, but he was busy, so we went after you. <laughs> oh, it's fun crazy. it's definitely fun uh so we will have uh, an event we, where um the uh, o media ai uh unit will come and uh, release that platform oh they're having beautiful progress so once that uh ready to be it it's already said there but and the technology, however, is just to uh, make it official, to launch it to the public and uh, to be able to present it to you. And there are going to be some heavy, heavy, heavy surprises on that because the people around it are not average. They're not this far, okay? <laughs> so <laughs> you're going to have some real intelligent people. <laughs> Wow, what a way to hurt our feelings, Ash. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, mine. I'm talking about myself. Oh, no. Uh -huh. You're the, hey, you're the, hey, you you're know, the drivers, you know, you're the captains. You know in three weeks what's happening, right? Three weeks, you know what's happening, right? That's a loaded so question. Up. Yeah, the, the grouper are running, brother. It's time to go fishing for a day. Oh, <laughs> really? Wow, I love that, yeah. Is it is it the season? Like... I did it. I don't know. It just, it just sounded something to work. get your attention. Yeah. I want to throw you full of positive vibes about fishing. That's all. Yeah, I thought March and April are heavy in, in, in the Key West uh, area. 
it, you know what they say about a good day of fishing is better than a bad day at work, you know, or something like that. Yeah, the opposite. I'm going to bring the laptops, the computers. I'll bring some of the tech guys just so you can put that pole in the water and catch a couple let's, fish. Let's disconnect completely from technologies and. I mean, <laughs> don't bring, don't bring you know that barbecue sauce stuff. Like for, for <laughs> lunch is on me. Okay, I'll take care of that. Keep your cooler in the garage or whatever. Okay, I bring the food. <laughs> and, 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 and Chris, before that happens, you can practice with utensils. You know what I mean? So you. <laughs> okay. Good lord. All right. Yeah. Thank you guys you. are rocking. Gonna... Keep keep up the good work. I love you. I respect you. And we're killing it here. I'm gonna go back to work. Uh, great things are about to happen, as they have been happening, and we'll continue doing that. Unpassive is a done deal. Uh, we will do it or die. And we have more in our bucket and our tank than any other thing that I've seen in my life. And I've seen a lot, and I see every day. And all the respect, you know, we learn so much from uh, those uh, great models ahead of us. Uh, but we're also uh, setting up a new bar, not not my bar, your passive bar. Right, thank, <laughs> passive thank, you thank you. Take care. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, thank Ash. You. Talk to you soon. Thanks very much. All right. Um, Woo! There you go. There, there you go. go. Oh. Hey everybody, we had 2,600 people, it climbed a thousand as soon as Ash came on. Uh, like we can't take the credit for that. We but thank you bar. everybody for being, yeah, he raised the bar, even though he came in under it, so he says. But anyway, uh, thank you everybody.